Okay, Ravi, I say the math question. Okay, let's go to the information. A line intersects two parallel lines forming four acute angles and four obtuse angles. The measure of one of the acute angles is 7x and 8 is 610. The sum of the measures of one of the acute angles and three of the obtuse angles is negative 14x positive W. What is the value of uh, W? Okay, now let me draw two parallel lines first. Okay, I've drawn two parallel lines. Now these two parallel lines intersected by another line. So I've drawn a line which intersects the two parallel lines. Okay, since uh, two parallel lines intersected by uh, yeah, another line, so four acute angles and four obtuse angles are formed. Okay, let me mark the acute angles in red color. Acute angle means it's an angle measured in zero degree and 90 degree. Let me mark the four acute angles in red color. So the four angles I marked over here in red color are acute angles. Okay, now let me mark the obtuse angles. The obtuse angle means uh, it will measure uh, from uh, 90 degree to 180 degree. So let me mark it in green color, uh, the four obtuse uh, angles. Let me do it. This one, this one, and uh, this one. So the four angles I marked in green color are obtuse angles. Okay, and uh, we have uh, the measure of one of the acute angles, uh, that is 7x uh, negative 610. Let me mark uh, this one, six, 7x negative 610. And we don't have the measure of uh, one of the obtuse angles. Uh, so let me assume uh, the one of the, I mean, the measure of one of the obtuse angles is just y degrees. So I can mark just y over here. Okay, so actually this is given in the question. This is a measure of uh, one of the acute angles. And uh, we don't have the measure of one of the obtuse angles. So I uh, just assume uh, the measure of one of the obtuse angles is y. Okay, now if I consider the stuff over here, uh, this y and 7x, uh, uh, negative 610, uh, the, both of them are, I mean, they are linear pair because they form a straight angle over here. So whenever two angles are form a straight angle, then they are considered to be linear pair and they must add up to 180 degree. So that is the y positive 7x uh, negative 610 uh, must be equals to 180. So like uh, we can add 610 to both sides. When I add 610 to both sides, this negative 610 positive 610 will cancel out. And we can write this y positive 7x as 7x positive y in alphabetical order. And uh, when I combine this positive 180 and uh, positive uh, 610, I'm getting positive 790. Okay, now let's uh, go to the other information in the question. That is uh, some of the measures of one of the acute angles and three of the obtuse angles. So we have to take one acute angle and three obtuse angles and we have to add them. They must add up, they add up to uh, this value, negative 14x positive W. So one of the acute angles is uh, that's, uh, 7x uh, negative uh, 610. And now uh, we have to take three obtuse angles, y, 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 because we assumed one of the, the measure of one of the obtuse angles as a y. So now we have taken one acute angle and three obtuse angles. The sum must be equal to negative 14x positive W according to the question. Okay, now what we can do is uh, we can uh, rearrange the terms on the left side over here. We can write this constant at last. Then I'm getting 7x positive y, uh, positive y, positive y, negative 610 equals to uh, negative 14x positive w. Okay, already we know that uh, the value of 7x positive y is uh, 790. So we can plug in 790 for this uh, 7x positive y. Let me do it. So 790 positive. When I combine this y and y, I'm getting 2y negative 610 uh, equals to negative 14x uh, positive w. Okay, positive. Uh, we can write this 2y at first. We can combine this 790 and uh, this uh, negative 610. When I combine these two values, I'm getting a uh, positive 180 equals to uh, negative 14x positive w. Okay, now let me add uh, 14x to both sides. Uh, let me do it. So when I add 14x to both sides, the negative 14x positive 14x will cancel out. And here on the left side, I'm getting 14x uh, positive 2y uh, positive 180 equals to w. Okay, now in the first two terms, uh, 14x positive 2y, I can factor 2 out. If I factor 2 out, so I'll be getting 7x positive y inside the parenthesis a uh, positive 180 equals to w. We know the value of this expression, 7x positive y, uh, that is 790. We can plug in this 790 for this 7x positive y. Okay, let me continue over here two times. So I'm going to plug in 790 for this 7x positive y. So 790 positive 180 equals to W. Okay, now, uh, so we have to multiply this uh, 790 by two. So when I multiply this uh, 790 by two, I'm getting uh, 1580 uh, positive 180 equals to W. Now I'm adding 1580 to uh, 180. Let me add it. When I add 1580 and uh, 180, I'm getting 1760 equals to W. I got the value of W. The value of W is 1760.